favorite Halloween costume of all time? Probably Batman. It's a great costume. You bet. Uh, last year I was the gingerbread man. You didn't go last year. No, last year at school I got a lot of kicks out of that one though. So, SpongeBob. You were the SpongeBob, were you? Yeah, that's pretty much the only one I've ever been. So, <laughs> uh, when I was a little kid, I was a giraffe. That was a good one. I was actually a yellow crayon last year. And I gotta ask, did you ever dress up like a hockey player? I have, yes. You hockey players, you're notorious for that. Uh, when I was little, I was uh, dressed up as Pikachu once. No. Yeah, I was a big Pokemon guy when I was little. Buzz Lightyear. Why Buzz Lightyear? Uh, I just, my mom dressed me up as it. Uh, I think when I was seven, my mom dressed me up as Woody from the Toy Story, and my little brother was Buzz Lightyear, so that'd be the most memorable one. How adorable were you guys? I was pretty cute. Who's most likely to go trick-or-treating this year? Brett Stapley, for sure. He's a cute little kid, looks like he loves candy, you know? Uh, I'd say uh, Brett Stapley, because he's still in high school. Uh, I'd say Jagger Williamson. What do you think he'd go as? Um, I have no idea. A little furball? <laughs> Brett Stapley. Is that because he's got a young face? <laughs> yeah, he's two years old. Uh, Jagger Williamson or Brett Stapley? Who's most likely to go trick-or-treating this year? Jagger Williamson. Why is that? Or myself, because we're the youngest. <laughs> uh, Brett Stapley. Everyone has Stapley picked. How come? He looks like he's five. Probably have to say Brett Stapley. Again, he's the runaway uh, winner on that one. Who on the team doesn't need to use a mask? Bubs. <laughs> and Bubs is? Riley, Riley Brent. Brent. <laughs> yes, it is. Mitch Oliver, for sure. Probably Mitch Oliver. Guy looks like Squidward. Who on the team doesn't need to use a mask? Uh, I gotta say Bo Pella. Uh, I'm gonna have to go with my buddy Bo Pella. Uh, I'm gonna have to go with Bo Pella. He's got a couple of votes already. What's what's wrong with him? Uh, pretty scary guy. Freaky face there. Uh, Mitch Oliver. Oh, it's getting great. Mitch Oliver's got a couple as well. Who on the team doesn't need to use a mask? And I gotta tell you, some people have picked you. I'd probably say Bo Pella. <laughs> so you're gonna throw one extra vote his way? Yeah, you bet. Favorite Halloween treat? Um, probably Reese's. Probably a Kit Kat bar. Candy bags. <laughs> uh, the best is when you get a full-size chocolate bar, for sure. Uh, full-size chocolate bars. Uh, probably the full-size chocolate bars are when you get a big bag of candy. Uh, those little peanut butter Reese's cups. Those are delicious. I'm with you on that one. Uh, I like Tootsie Rolls. You do. N nobody likes Tootsie Rolls. Everyone likes Tootsie Rolls. <laughs> You're the first guy I've ever met. What treat should people just never give out? Apples. Juice boxes. Did you actually get juice boxes? Yeah. <laughs> awful, <laughs> awful Halloween. Uh, one year I remember I got a pack of carrots. I don't know why I got carrots. That was terrible. Uh, when I was little I got a bag of carrots once. And it's just, uh, it's frustrating when you get vegetables. Any fruit or vegetable. <laughs> why is that? It's Halloween, it's candy, strictly candy. Uh, one year I got a toothpaste. Oh, that's awful. That, that's a dentist for sure. That is, that was. Uh, I've never liked black licorice. I think that's an awful candy. Probably say a juice box. That's just not a treat, is it? No, it isn't. No, that's like school lunch. Yeah, exactly. What would you dress up your head coach as? Uh, that's a tough one. Probably a <laughs> ballerina or something. Oh, uh, I can see Mark making a nice fairy. Kevin Peterson, probably Harry Potter. How about Ferner as a big teddy bear? Yeah, that's a good one. Uh, I could see Mark being the Grinch. Especially lately. Uh, I'd probably have to say Superman. Why Superman? Because he's the boss. And he also controls your ice time? Exactly. Uh, I'd probably go with Jackie Moon off of uh, Semi Pro, and then for Krauser, I'd give him a wig and he can go as a girl. What would you dress your head coach up as? And for you, that's dad. I think I'd dress him up as a butter maker off the Bad News Bears. Uh, I don't know what I'd dress up uh, head coach up as, but I'd probably dress this Krauser up as uh, Macklemore, give him a little fur court there.